Hello everyone, this is TDU Shelby. For those of you who are interested, um, I'm going to be moving pretty soon. So I'm going to give a quick tour of my room, which won't take too long. But for those of you who are interested in my airsoft collection, check the info panel over there. And just, well, go to the time listed there. Starting with the, to the right, my guitar, which is a silver tone. Nice little dong noise there. I don't think it's quite tuned. Um, my random RC. That's the bow that came on my truck for my birthday. Yeah, that's dirt. That's laundry. Um, there's my radio. The pause button to the tape is busted. I've had it for quite some time. There's my history book, my huge collection of game informers, a GameCube, and an Xbox, which is like right there. Not my TV. I do not feel like it's, I didn't steal it, if that's what you're wondering. Forgot what I was watching last night. Oh yeah, random, I don't have very many games for my Xbox, or my original Xbox, but there it is. Um, oh, these shelves right here were supposed to be on that wall. Well, they fell on me not too long ago, and that one fun. This floor lamp is going to be in my hall for, on an upcoming video, so stay tuned. This is a whole bunch of school books, a California highway sign, a ruler, and the styrofoam to one of my airsoft guns. This is my closet, which is full of terrible things, meaning junk. And this is my absolute favorite Garfield comic of all time. Um, just uh, check the Garfield.com or whatever, and it's one. Of, it's like last Sunday's comic. And I am man enough to admit I have a kitty calendar that I acquired today. This is my beautiful computer monitor and computer that has been alive for several years but is not beautiful enough to run Crisis. Boo. Short tour, tour of my room. So I guess I could go directly to my airsoft collection to appease the masses. Alrighty then. We're going to start off with the first airsoft gun that I've ever owned. Electric. It's the electric. I think it's a cyber gun M9. Or it's an M9. Um, I think it's cyber gun. It's got a slide that is surprisingly, you know, for plastic, this is actually pretty good quality. Like this slide, that's like the that's like the one of the like I don't have any other pistols like this, so I don't know how good a slide could be. But I have to admit, just from what I've seen, this is a very good slide. First one I ever owned. I have a review of it on my channel. Please pardon my voice. It hadn't changed yet. Don't think I'm gay. Please. This is the second gun I ever owned, which is a huge step up. UTG M324 accessories are on, including the strap. Where is it? Yeah, sling. Good string. Or, good sling. Hadn't done anything to me yet. Scope is unsighted. Um, this is the next gun that I owned. Um, I got for, I think it was Christmas last year. Auto Ordnance Corporation CYMA Thompson M1A1. Hey, what do you know? The logo is actually right side up. Fully licensed. It malfunctioned some time ago. Like, you can still pull the trigger, and it's great. It's great as a movie prop, but otherwise, it's just a piece of crap right now. I mean, it's. I'm not going to get rid of it. But, okay, now, if somebody were to offer me. Like, uh, 75 bucks, maybe 50 I might, um, sell it to you, but I doubt it. 
This came free with the gun because I got it from the Capali Boneyard. These little three, these little springers were free with any purchase from Capali for a while. It was a springer. Nice little magazine there. Now this is the most expensive one in my collection and it's the Wind Gun M702 Airsoft Revolver. Just a quick overview. Working decogger, full metal, full metal shells, CO2 powered, yeah, very good quality. Came with, comes with a speed loader and a few other odds and ends. That's my very tiny airsoft armory, or yeah, airsoft armory. Um, I hope to get a review on this, of this and this pretty soon. I really hope to get these reviews on ASAP because I know most of you probably subscribe because of my M324 review and I don't want to disappoint you. I know some of you are actually probably itching to learn about this piece. Beautiful. Like, I mean, this is like the most beautiful, one of the most beautiful airsoft guns I've ever seen. Oh, even has a work in safety. <laughs> Anyway, this is Keegan Shelby signing off, saying um, thank you for subscribing, rating, commenting, ignoring my busted trash can, and my spelling book. Um, take care, and that's my foot. <laughs>